not everything is being reported on the news and sometimes what you don't know can really really cost you cost you a lot in the future so let me make you aware as to what is going on i this is another my view tv exclusive please remember to hit the notification bell like share and subscribe <laughs> I don't bring nobody forward in your future for me. Everything where you see up my natural talent. Let me tell you something. You see, when you know what to please the audience with, it's simple, me. What go on, my people? Hope everybody is okay. Hope everybody is alright. Jan Oster, only listen that a while ago. I go make you hear that full interview then because I don't know this girl. Yeah. But what I always tell you, I always come and tell you and everything I come on the news and then I hide something. But you see me, I'm all about public awareness. Yeah, man. You see, once I can save a life or two or tell somebody something I can save a life or two, I go do it. Remember, so we now do this for the likes and the views over here. So, you know. News we are read and we make the people them be aware of them surrounding. You understand that anything we are going. So if we go along the road and we see two little boys ride a bicycle, them drop off and them chip up, we come come report it. Because probably their mother and their father there, so I want to know why. Them ride a bicycle and drop off. And if we see one them thief one little girl and push her in one car, we are going to reveal the car and the people them know. So watch her. Find a little girl with them put in this car. You understand? Them still not find Jasmine Dean yet. And them all are one man and the commissioner that talk about it. But we are waiting for further upon that. You understand? But in regards to this taxi man here last night, people, I have this video here. I'm going to show you, you know. This taxi man here will lick down this woman and lick off all her foot and them something there. What if it was my mother? What this taxi man could have tell me? That is what I want to know. I'm tired to tell them take them time on the road. So they know the drill already, you know. They know the drill go. It could even blow real for me, put it up. Me, I'll be honest with you. Know. So, more want to just forward and come, come ask sweet. And then again, we throw it in our, in our chat group to see him. Because we have a local group, our local group are going good. I'm telling you, so the people who come over there with a different agenda, don't bother come. Yeah, man, if you don't forward over there, if you have a different agenda, you don't forward over there, you understand? We are the our thing over here, so, and we are keep ourselves to ourselves. And we are right. But anyway, I'm going to make you hear this interview. I can't put up the whole of the interview on the My View TV. Yes, so, so, just log on on the Ground TV and get a full interview over there. So, just go and go listen. You understand? Be aware, people, of your surrounding. You need to know what take place. Yeah, man, it's too much time. I'm telling you, I'm telling you, you know, we have to reason sometime. You understand? It's not all about throwing this and this and this and this and this and this and this. People must know what are going on and them little surround and them little circle. And the people them who know look people them who do look bad things them push them out. You understand? Can remember how buying a fugitive is a crime. Hi guys, I come to you to share this story of an incident that occurred on November twenty seventh. 2020 as a means of bringing awareness to everybody as to what is going on not everything is being reported on the news and sometimes what you don't know can really really cost you cost you a lot in the future so let me make you aware as to what is going on i it has struck close to me now twice and this time it it devastated me even more because it's a it's a friend of mine that's the same age and everything so it could have happened to me um she went to take a taxi to go to work on the friday and uh, around seven o'clock at harborview bus stop she was a taxi came up uh black something close to a Noah was a seven-seater came up saying town and she decided to go into the vehicle red plate by the way um, a gentleman was in the back with a, a woman very cozy and another man was in the front seat with the driver and in that middle section there had an next man she went in after the vehicle drove off she didn't like the feeling she had so she decided she wanted to come off she asked the driver to let her off um, she was met by a gun in her face to say she's not going anywhere 
the other young lady in the back was also then she realized that the young lady in the back was also crying so it seemed she was also being robbed or she's a part of the whole thing they tie strapped her um put her on the floor and used her face mask to cover her eyes they took her cards they took her phones and uh, they asked for the password they drove around to several ATMs to draw money from her card. Remember, this is Friday after payday and she is a frontline worker. So this is just really sad that the persons that are putting out to ensure that we're doing good or trying to help out the COVID situation, you're doing this to them. So um, they drove around with her from 7 to about 11 o'clock in the vehicle and um, they were trying to pick up other persons along the way and uh, they, when they searched her, they even at one point used her card at a store to do point of sale because you know at that point you can't draw any more money from the card so they wanted to max out everything. They wiped her clean all her all of her pay was removed from her account any money she had was removed from her account and they picked up a one that she decided she was just being very noisy and they started to beat her thump lick whatever was happening she couldn't necessarily see what's going on but they were she could hear what's going on they threatened to shoot the woman and uh, I guess at this point when they were holding the gun to her head the lady stopped. There's an elderly woman because um, she was advised, they were advised once they stop to pick up anybody they're gonna draw the mask down to their, to their mouth. They shouldn't look at them, the guys. And if they signal to, to anybody coming in then they'll shoot them. So two guys in the vehicle had had a had a gun. Um, she is she was not seeing where she was going exactly. Um, after they took her phones, after eleven they let her off. Like I said before, me can't go play the full thing right as so, so go over Grung TV. Go listen what I go on. You understand? G R U N G TV. If you look on the screen after this, you yeah, see it. And you can just go over there and you see what I go on. I try to say, I can pin it in the comment section. So, when you can go over there, click on it and listen with this lady have to say. She never have to come, come tell nobody, you know. She could have keep it to herself. But you want people to know what I go on. Just like the brother will show the security picture, I could know say the security get beat up at what point and what place. And which part him go for get beat up, they never have to do them thing there. But public awareness, tell a friend, tell a friend, check us out.